Adam Tyske from Closed Archers Tunnels, and today we're going to demo the Blast Furnace here at St. Vitus Bar in Brooklyn. Uh, this is an original fuzz, and uh, it's gated with a delay on the momentary switch. The delay works with or without the fuzz being on. You've got tone bypass or tone on, you can adjust it with the trim pot. Uh, today we are going to have Steve Brodsky of Mutoid Man and Cave In, which inspired this whole day, uh, to play the song Cave In by the band Cody. Enjoy. This is Steve Brodsky. What's up? New Toy Man, Cave In. Um, I was driving home from a Stompbox Sonic event in Boston, and Cave In's cover of the coding song Cave In came on. And when I was thinking about how to demo this pedal, this song felt like it fit perfectly to capture this general sound from what they did. So I asked Steve, and he agreed. So, I sure did. I was very happy to agree to this project um, for a number of reasons. I'm a big fan of Fuzz Rocious. I love all the gadgets, the electronic goodies, the surprise element of what Ryan's cooking up next. And I do think this song actually was a great way to demonstrate the pedal because it's, at least Caven's cover of the song is very low end heavy. Um, it is very much dominated by Caleb Schofield in the sonic department. And, um, you know, I don't know why JR and Adam weren't 
present on the recording. It's sort of strange. Those days are a little foggy. There are little pockets of blackout, but um, hey, um, for this purpose, I think it served pretty well to recreate, for the most part, what was going on with the uh, original cover version. So uh, I'm tweaking it to make it work for this thing. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you were doing this cool sort of rhythmic element with the expression pedal. Um, that kind of helped my bad timing. <laughs> Um, and it also was a cool way to demonstrate how to use this thing in another way. Wouldn't have Steve come here and help us demo the Blast Furnace with Kaven's cover of Codeine because in a fever idea, a drive home from Boston, it felt like a thing that fit. Yeah, it made a lot of sense to me because that song, at least Kaven's version of it, is very, very low end heavy, it's pretty much dominated by Caleb Schofield, the bass player of Caveman. Um, so I thought it was a very worthwhile experiment for this particular gadget. So in a feverish idea, I'm going to drive home from Boston, the Caveman cover of Codeine came on and the song spoke to me in the way the pedal speaks to me as well. Um, it felt like a really good fit, so I contacted Steve to come in and recreate it here live. Yeah, what a treat. Um, I thought it was a great idea because Caven's version of that song is very low-end heavy. I mean, it's pretty much dominated by Caleb Schofield and the recording that we did of it. Um, so I was very much all about the experiment that we're about to partake in. Let's partake. <laughs> 